First, crews are still working to put out a massive fire in western North Carolina. Right now it sits at 434 acres. It's 30% contained tonight. Uh, more than double the containment just from yesterday. Now, air quality concerns have also been an issue throughout the week. And as hundreds of firefighters are in that fight in Henderson County, they're getting some help from the sky. The North Carolina Forest Service deploying drones each night. And Fox Carolina's Zach Prolutsky tagged along with a drone pilot tonight. He has that story from Henderson County. While most people are asleep, Matt Bishop has been hard at work in Henderson County since Monday. We come out every night and um, we fly a certain gridded area. Bishop is a drone pilot with the North Carolina Forest Service. That's what we're looking for. Looking for hot spots in the Poplar Drive wildfire. Um, it just saves a lot of energy walking around and um, tying up resources looking for hot spots versus working on hot spots. Before 2018, firefighters in North Carolina would have to walk an entire containment zone to find hot spots. Now, this has three cameras. It can be done a thousand feet in the air. Drones are the biggest technological improvement we've had. The drone takes thermal pictures about every five seconds. Here's what they look like in real time. That's actually what they burn today. Each morning, those pictures are stitched together as a map and given to firefighters on the front lines. Fortunately, it's, it's getting less every night, but there's still a lot of heat out there. And the one thing we're worried about is the uh, leaves that are remaining on the trees are falling um, due to the wind and it just being fall. And there's a potential for those leaves to catch back on fire. In Henderson County, Zach Perlutsky, Fox Carolina News.